Hey guys, welcome to part 39. In the last episode, we've been rampaging through Team Flare's area since they apparently plan on destroying all of reality. So, well, all the planet. Well, they're gonna use Superweb to destroy a lot of things to create a clean slate for Team Flare, so it's kinda bad. Ha, huh, it sure does feel good to let loose every once in a while. In spite of people's holocaust, the conversations gets boring pretty quickly after all. Oh, duh! Lysandro is what made the holocaster, so of course they'd set it up so they could spy on them. You little jerks. You communist. I'm taking you down. Sorry about that. Spying on people's holocasters. Yay, the Gario. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Forget. Let's see. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Aura Sphere is Aura Sphere is pretty great, but close combat's even better. Okay, and I'll just try and call you. Sure. No. Oh. Nice. My Pokemon would like to let loose every once in a while too. Sorry. Forgot to set my timer for this episode. Okay. Here we go. Da -da 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 you! Oh, oh, you're that kid from the Frost Cavern. On your lonesome this time? Yes. Oh, that's cold. Cold in the cavern. Your Pokemon don't even count for anything? You got a data. Wait, what? Well, I'm on my own. I'm on my own. It's me and my Pokemon. It's only me, and my Pokemon, you know, it's like we're a team, we're a group. We gather data about all the trainers in the region through the Holocaster, so we know all about you, what? And you know how the Mega Ring is used to awaken Pokemon's power, right? Just like, just like how the ultimate weapon can max out a Pokemon's power. Hey, it looks like you and me are practically after the same thing, yeah? No. Team Flare Mabel. I'm not after the same thing as you. I'm out, I'm after to, my goal is to be the very best like no one ever was, to catch them as my real test to train them is my cause. It is not my goal to destroy everyone in order to make a perfect society because that's not how things work. Blue. No. Good job, Green Love 55. Ooh, ooh, yes. Dragon Rush, let's see. The user tackles the target while exhibiting overwhelming menace. User, this may also make the target flip. Ah, 75% accuracy. Ooh. Yeah, I'll, I'll go for it. That ultimate power is really nice. Dragon Rush. Weavile. All right, so you dragon rush. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh oh oh! Bad 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 bad! Bring it out there! That was really cool. Yay, Garchomp! Go Blaze again. Go Venusaur. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, okay. I need some time to think about this. I'm gonna say no. See, if I was running a chlorophyll set, you know, like Sunny Day, and then like you Sunny Day, and then have Solar Beam and everything, I would. But he doesn't have chlorophyll, and really, I should have just kept. Yeah, I probably should have kept Petal Dance. <laughs> Come to think about it, yeah, I probably should. have. So, no. Keep old moves. If you had chlorophyll as an ability, I would definitely go for it, but nope. Ooh, you're strong. You and your Pokemon are most certainly not ordinary. I still can't train my Venusaur because Team Flare would eat it alive. Ding, ding, ding. Yep, you did it. To the victor goes the spoils. Here, an elevator key for you. Why wouldn't you just lie through your teeth and say you don't have it? 
The power of the legendary Pokemon, the power to grant life to all around it. It's mysterious to that even scientists like us haven't been able to really decode. What do you think will happen to the world if we feel the ultimate weapon is something like that? Let's see, go here. Go here. Alright. Let's see, who's. Oh! Voice went bad. <coughs> Sorry about that. Alright, I need to train you, but Team Flare's Pokemon are contradictory to you, so I can't. I still need to train Drif Driplin. Oh, I thought there was Pokemon back here. Alright, I better get going. You need to find my way back to the beginning. If I'd stop choking! On what? I don't know why I'm choking. It's M. No, 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 no. Huh, great. Okay, uh, let's go this way. There we go. This is a very... This is a very nice elevator. So, cut me plush and swish. Alright. Fall down there. Whoa, that guy's tall. Listen. Listen, one who will face Lysander. Dude, you're huge. Seriously, you're like really, really tall. I thought that was just like the angle we were at. Whoa, hello. A terribly long time ago. Story time. There was a man in a Pokemon. He loved that Pokemon very much. It was a fairy. A war began. Oh, wow. The man's beloved Pokemon took part in the war. Wow. Several years passed. He was given a tiny box. The man wanted to bring the Pokemon back, no matter what it took. Aww, it died! That's sad. Why did he participate in the war? The man built a machine to give it life. He, bought, he brought his beloved Pokemon back. Wow, really? With no problems? Impressive. To flip baby. The man had suffered too much. His rage still had not subsided. But you got your Pokemon back! And you discovered a way to bring things back from the dead! How great is that? He could not forgive the world that had hurt the Pokemon he loved. He turned the machine into the ultimate weapon. Oh, uh, you're like a really brilliant scientist, so this could be very bad. Whoa! Oh dear. Whoa! The man became a bringer of destruction that ended the war. The Pokemon that was given life must have known. That the lives of many Pokemon were taken to restore its life. Oh, he used the life source of other Pokemon. The resurrect Pokemon left the man. Oh, that's sad. That's a sad story. Get the key back. It should not be used. Everything will vanish again. Do you want to know unending pain like I have? Dude, you're that guy then. 
This is AZ. He is that same name as the king that lived 3,000 years ago. And for some unknown reason, he had the key to the ultimate weapon hung around his neck. It's finally time. Follow me to my chambers. Dude! My Sandra! Uh, where, where is he? Oh, oops. Okay, why would I even let Lysander walk past you just like, uh, no. I'm not even gonna let you use the super weapon. I'm going to defeat you. Get back here. Hello. Who is that? So the Pokemons we received and the Pokemon we've gathered are where they need to be. And add it all up and it means all preparations are complete. The only thing left to do is put the plan in motion. I'm counting on you. Who's that dude? One push of a button, we can activate the ultimate weapon from this room. I believe being a chosen one means you have the potential to change the future. Whether we activate the ultimate weapon or leave it safely under God, rest upon if you actually have this potential or not. Why am I letting him walk away? Oh ho ho! You're the one I've heard so much about. I've been waiting for you. I need to do a little research on you. Come, let us begin. You are charged by Team Flare Xerosic. Crobat! Finally! I've been waiting for you. Alright. Thunderbolt. Ouch. Okay, Thunderbolt. Go team! Wait, Malmar? Oh, wow! That's a freaky looking thing. Alright, Thunder Wave! The opposing Malamar is paralyzed. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Ouch, ouch, oh! Drift Lab! No! Curses. All right, you asked for it, buddy. Wait. Garchomp. Yep, Garchomp. You asked for it, buddy. Sure. Sure. Superpower. Oh, you have you must have the ability contrary. You fought well. Wait, Hayes. What's Hayes do? Yeah, nah. Keep old moves. Yeah. You fought well, Driftlim. Oh, you're wonderful. Your Pokemon are amazing. Wonderful, amazing. You have tremendous skill and bravery. When you add that up, it means I'll tell you something. It means I'll tell you something very interesting. It happened three thousand years ago. The ultra weapon was used to put an end to the war in an instant. If we use that incredible power, we can finally free cows of the foolish humans that plague it. Behind me, you'll find a red button, and a blue button. One of them is a button for activating the ultra weapon. Push one now! Come on, push one! Oh, yeah. Uh. Uh. I'll be honest. Alright, if I was them... I would be evil and rig both the buttons to do it, so it's like, ha-ha! So, okay. Max, what are you doing? I'm getting a quarter out of my pocket. You're doing what? I'm getting a quarter out of my pocket. Tails. 
I'm gonna ignore it. All right, blue. Yes. You pressed it. Oh ho ho! You pressed the blue switch. Winner, winner! Congratulations. But I'm still going to activate the ultimate weapon. I know the boss promised that we would tell you if you push the trick button, but I refuse to let the potential go to waste. I'll just use my remote here. Click, click, and the power is on. Drip limb! Slug out his soul! Drip limb! Oh dear. Oh. What have I done? Um... Greninja! Greninja, kill him! Someone! Someone kill him! <laughs> oh my! This isn't good. This is bad! Oh, what have I done? Why would you give me a choice if you're just going to activate it anyway? Someone, cut the cords! What? Oh, you knocked all the houses over! What just happened? Did you see? The ultimate weapon is reborn! The poisonous flower has bloomed! All shall perish except for Team Flare. Look at Geosedge. It's bloomed in Geosedge Town. The boss tree would create a beautiful world will come true. And it all up and it equals a victory for our science. Oh, no you don't. Oh, no you don't. No you don't, mister. I'm gonna go ahead and... Floor one, please. Thank you. I'm heading to Geosedge Town. Max, you can't possibly hope to destroy it that way. Says you! Nobody here even... Oh, oops. Nobody here even knows what's going on! Okay, first I need to heal Pokemon. Really quick. Ah. Ah. Guys, the world's gonna burn! That... Uh, where... Where is... Poke Center, Poke Center, Poke Center, Poke Center, Poke Center. Ah! Pokemon Center, Pokemon Center, Pokemon Center, Pokemon Center, Pokemon Center. Pokemon Center. People! Wait, 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 there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Come on! No time for asking questions! Just go, 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 go! Hurry up! Sir, can you please just calm down? Go destroy that machine! I actually have no idea if, oops, I actually have no idea if this is how I'm supposed to destroy it, but you know. Uh, you, uh, you guys, but it seems like a pretty stinking good plan. Oh, Cheers, Edge! Okay. There's gotta be ways to destroy this thing. Okay. There we are, this way. You better have come prepared, both you and your Pokemon. Oh, I'm shutting this party down, boy. Did I say I'll shut this party down? Triplum, get out of there. 
Get out of there. Let Garchomp handle it. Okay, dig. See, this is a real life situation. I wouldn't even bother to have one Pokemon at, at a time. I would send like three out and they just mob the guy. Alright, one down. Crafty. Hey, Dragon Rush. Ah, curses. Why did it change? Uh, never mind. Okay, Dragon Rush. Sure. Sure. Okay, go back. Fight, Dragon Rush. Sure. Sure. Behold the moment of my defeat. Don't even think about blinking. Okay, me, I keep going. Let's hear he does whatever he can to help us realize our goal. Certainly deserves respect for that. Don't even think you can run from me. Max, I'm coming with you. But as I said, just loud, the mass heroes told me what's going on. They also told me that Team Flare plans to do the open weapon. Call us up, Team Flare. No, we have to stop Lysandra himself. The world isn't corrupt enough to give up on it yet. What, you mean there is a level that we could totally destroy the planet and it's totally justified? Where's Serena? Oh, well. I don't need Serena. Me and my Pokemon. Wow, now you're gonna stop. Attach the stones of our terror and energy source for using the ultimate weapon. I'll leave my fate to Lysandra, but I'm worried about tomorrow. I've been saved by Lysandra's support. We're, we're absorbing the energy from the mysterious street. But that's it, there isn't a Pokemon anywhere near here. All systems are go for the ultimate weapon. All we have to do is charge it using every bit of that thing's power. Everyone, the whole world must be happy before any one person can be happy. But the world is too big and there are too many people and Pokemon, so there isn't enough happiness to go around. You. Okay, really quick. I'm thinking that there's going to be a moment where... Whoa! Whoa, tree! See, I'm thinking if it's a legendary, if I fail, I can just shut down the game and restart. The ultra weapon's flower has finally bloomed above the soil. Don't you find its beauty captivating? As we speak, it draws its energy from the legendary Pokemon. Max, I apologize this weapon has unearthed even after you chose correctly in the lab. But conflict egos drive this world. Things don't always go the way you want. So I did choose right. We're not going to let you use the ultimate weapon. Even though resources, space, oh, even though resources, space, and energy on this planet are limited, the number of people and Pokemon has increased to an unsustainable level. Whether it's money or energy, the ones who steal are the ones who win in this world. That doesn't give you the right to destroy everyone, but the one Team Flare chooses. So tell me, the Mega Ring, did you share it? That's different. We competed for it, but when there's only one of something, it can't be shared. When something can't be shared, it'll be fought over. And when something is fought over, some must survive without it. The only way to create a world where people live in beauty, a world without conflict or theft, is to reduce the number of living things. What about Pokemon? What was that? Tears. Why? Pokemon shall no longer exist. What? Pokemon are wonderful beings. Humans have worked with Pokemon, and we have helped each other flourish. But precisely because of that, they will inevitably become tools for war and theft. That's what you're using them for. Enough of this. You want to stop the ultimate weapon, and I refuse to do so. So I'll keep you busy for just a moment. You are challenged by Team Flare Lysander. You know, I'm actually thinking something really cool and dramatic is gonna. Wow, you got a lot bigger since the last episode. You know, some... I'm thinking something really cool and dramatic is gonna happen. Uh, happen between this battle and the next part, and we're out of time. So the next episode, we're gonna see if we can shut down this mega weapon problem. So, see you then!